Nancy Pelosi teed up the Democrats' latest plan to remove President Trump from office. Pelosi's scheme revolved around inventing a scandal surrounding Attorney General William Barr and his handling of the release of the Mueller report. But Sean Hannity went on Fox News and shut down Nancy Pelosi's impeachment plan with just five words. Democrats are now screaming cover-up about Attorney General Barr releasing a lightly redacted version of the Mueller report. They cite a March 27 letter when Robert Mueller complained that Barr's March 24 release of Mueller's key findings did generate enough anti-Trump media coverage. The scandal is fake. Barr subsequently made a lightly redacted version of the report available to the public so everyone can read the report for themselves and see Barr did not conceal or mislead on any of Mueller's findings. But Democrats, with the permission and blessing of Nancy Pelosi, created a media circus to make it seem like Attorney General Barr had something to hide. Attorney General Barr had agreed to testify before the House Judiciary Committee to explain his decision-making process, but canceled when Democrats took the unprecedented step to have staff attorneys and not the committee members question Barr. Democrats staged a bit of political theater by calling a hearing with an empty chair and berating Barr for supposedly carrying out a cover-up on behalf of President Trump. Tennessee Democrat Steve Cohen, who sits on the Judiciary Committee, appeared on Anderson Cooper's CNN program after Cohen ate a bucket of Kentucky Fried Chicken during the hearing to signify his belief Barr was afraid of what the Democrats would uncover. During the interview, Cohen escalated his attacks on Barr by demanding the House Sergeant of Arms arrest the Attorney General for refusing to appear at the Democrats' kangaroo court hearing. Do you actually, uh, actually support the idea of, I mean, putting him in, uh, uh, are you talking about just having him sit for a hearing or, or locking him up somehow? Uh, you have to have him sit for a hearing, and I think you have to have him locked up in case, unless he, he agrees to participate and it come to the hearing. Sean Hannity addressed the Democrats' increasing desperation after Robert Mueller was forced to admit their two-year-long push on the Russian collusion and obstruction of justice conspiracy theories ended in failure. Welcome to Saddam Hussein's America, Hannity declared after playing the clip of Cohen demanding his political opponents be jailed. Democratic congressman wants to handcuff. Get this. The Attorney General of the United States have the sergeant of arms drag him before the committee or to prison. No trial, no charges, nothing. Well, welcome to Saddam Hussein's USA. As much as Democrats want to kick up a fuss about the Mueller report, the truth is very simple. Hannity pointed out that the bottom line is there was no evidence of conspiracy with Russia and no determination on obstruction of justice. The case is closed. If you are fed up with all the fake news from the so-called mainstream media and want real news that you can trust, please hit the subscribe button on our YouTube channel.